Hi, welcome to this video tutorial on a cover order. What is a cover order? A cover order is a multi-legged order with a primary order and a second legged stop loss order. What it does is it helps you avail of higher margin benefits and charges the margin only to the extent of the difference between your entry order price and your stop loss price. Obviously, this is subject to a minimum percentage margin. So what is a buy cover order and what is a sell cover order? A buy cover order can be entered from the orders and trades option in the cover order entry option and selecting buy cover order entry. The shortcut key for the same is shift plus F1. If your view is bullish on the market or on the commodity or on the security and you want to go long with lower margin requirements and higher leverage, select the buy cover order. In case your view on a particular stock, security or commodity is bearish and you want to go short with lower margin requirements and higher leverage, select the sell cover order from the menu options. The shortcut key for the same is shift plus F2. The margin available in the cover order is actually the difference between the entry price and the stop loss which is subject to a minimum margin percentage. You can calculate the margin requirements for a cover order on the Samco website. Let's say you want to calculate the margin requirement on a contract of gold and the entry price for the transaction is 25,000 rupees. The quantity is, is 1 kilo and the stop loss that you want to enter is 24,800. When you press calculate, you shall be able to check that the margin on gold is only Rs. 41,250 which is approximately 1.65% of the value of the contract. Let's say you want to enter a cover order. Go to the cover order entry dialog box. Now let's go through the different elements of entering the order. There are two options. You can enter a limit order or a market order for the primary leg of the order. A limit order means that the order will be executed at a particular price and a market order means that the order will be executed instantly at the best available price. Let's say you want to enter a limit order. Then select the quantity that you want to enter. Select the price. So let's say you want to enter gold at Rs 24,500. You can also enter the disclosed quantity. This has to be a minimum of 10% of the quantity. In most cases, we recommend you to avoid inputting a disclosed quantity. Coming to the stop loss market sell entry. Please note that the maximum trigger price range for this contract of gold is mentioned herein. That means that your stop loss can be only entered in this range. Also, the 2.75% max margin means that your stop loss cannot exceed 2.75%. So let's say in this case you want to enter the trigger price as 24300 which is just above the lower limit of the trigger price range. Once you have entered the stop loss trigger price, click on submit. You will be able to view your order in the order book. Let's say you want to cancel this a particular order or modify this particular order. In, you, in order to modify this particular order, simply click on modify and you will be able to modify the price of the order. Let's say you want to modify the price from 24500 to 24600. Change the price and click on submit. Let's say in case you want to cancel the order. In case the primary leg of the order is already executed, and only the stop loss order is trigger pending which is the trigger pending status order in that case you will not be allowed to cancel the order but you will be able to exit the trade by clicking exit but in this case since the primary order that is in case of a limit order is not yet executed you can completely cancel both the legs of the order by selecting the primary order which has a status of open and clicking on exit and your order will be cancelled. Important question, can cover orders get rejected? Yes, in two cases cover orders can get rejected. 
Number one, in case in the cash market, the script is not permitted for the cover order. Or number two, the stop loss trigger percentage exceeds the maximum permitted difference. That is, in case you enter a very very large stop loss. Also, an important point to note is that in case your second leg of the cover order is not executed before the close of the market, it will get automatically squared off by the risk management and surveillance system of Sanfe at 3:15 in case of the equity market, at 4:45 in case of the currency derivative market, and 30 minutes prior to the close of the commodity market. Thank you for your time for viewing this short video tutorial on cover orders. Thank you.